Hi, this is Sonia Mez with Apple Tree Home School Academy and Apple Tree Home Daycare. And today I have some directional monkeys. They come from CarsoDeLosaPublishing.com. You anybody can go on their website and order. Check around for free shipping. Sometimes they have free shipping, so check around on their website. And what these are, these are cutouts. And this two different kinds of monkeys, one with one hand up, a little darker, one with um, the other hand up, and then four colors of barrels. You can put them up or on the side, and then what you do is take the monkeys and put them either on one side, the other, on top, below, and talk about prepositional directional uh, words. So um, I've laminated them, cut the lamination off, and attached them. Um, um, self-adhesive magnetic tape on the back and we're going to do an activity and put these on the whiteboard now i have two children today a new child which is it's the toddler's first day and i have four new and um we're going to do this with the new four-year-old and uh two of my other children are absent they've taken a long holiday weekend so this is going to be good to talk one-on-one -on -one with charlie and have an individual lesson. Lesson, Charlie. First, what we're going to do is we're going to put our barrels on there, and we'll talk about the colors. So, what color is this? Red. Okay, go ahead and put that on our whiteboard. Okay. What color is this? Blue. Okay, put that on our board. And then this color. Green. Okay. And. Yellow and black. Good. And, and we're going to put monkeys in the barrel. Get one barrel and put the monkey on top of a barrel. You can move it down if you like. Okay, I move the, move the barrels down so he can have room. Here, Charlie, he put this below the barrel. Below the barrel. Do you know what below means? Okay, it's underneath. How do we put it underneath the barrel? Yeah. All right. Get one of your monkeys and put it underneath the barrel. This one? Yeah. And that's also called below. Below the barrel. Okay. We're going to talk about right side. Charlie, can you put that on the right side? Actually, good job. What? Let's take that monkey and put it on the left side. Do you know what the left side would be? The other side of the barrel. That's the right side of the barrel. And I will show you on your hand. If you go like that, look, this is your left hand. This is your left hand. If you put your thumb like that and hold it, like, and look, this makes an L. Hold your hand still real quick for a second. Look, hold your hand still. Put your thumb down. There you go. This makes an L. Put your thumb down. Out like that makes an L, and that means left. L for left. So this is your left hand, and this is your right hand. So this is the left side, and this is the right side. Good. So you're using your right hand, and this is your left hand. So right side and left side. Isn't that neat? Okay, let's count how many monkeys do we have. One, two, three, four. Good. Now we're going to practice reading uh, a reading strategy working left to right. One, two, three, four. And so I worked from left to right, and that is another reading strategy. So now I'm just going to let him play. So now I'm just going to let him play with this and interact with the monkeys. Once Charlie's done, I'm going to let the new little boy play. He can just put the items on the whiteboard. So if you like this activity, this video, like, share, subscribe, and comment. Thanks. Have a great week.